Alright, folks, so Pachinis88, we are back playing Tales from Borderlands. Episode 1 Zero Sum. Let's get on with this. Now, we would. So, as with all games, they will, Telltale Games, they'll adapt, adapt to the twist that we make. Back again to hear another story of immense fortune and unthinkable peril. Well, I have some time. The borderlands of Pandora were told to contain mysterious alien treasure troves filled with advanced technology and incredible power. Vaults, the people called them. And to seek one out was to earn you the title of Vault Hunter. At least by me. You could say Handsome Jack was one such explorer, though his methods could be seen as uh, somewhat unsporting. He ran the corporation Hyperion, and died trying to claim Pandora as his own. History's attention is fickle, my friends. It will remember those pirates like Handsome Jack, but forget the adventurers who risk it all for less, ah, uh, obvious rewards. Stories, legends, those are much better at getting at the real spirit of things. Stories remember both sides of the tale. So I'd like to give a shout out to Ralphie the Stud, Chad BC, Southpaw Babe 5, and Gruesome Shoe 7. All friends that played Borderlands 2 with me had tons of fun with that. I played Borderlands 1 to the ground. This is just something that I love the Borderlands series. I've heard rave reviews about this. I wanted to show it in all of its glory. So you will be seeing it in 60 frames per second, 1080p, 920, 1920 by 1080. Fiona! Come on, we can work this out! Fiona? <laughs> what, is there some sort of radiation leak I don't know about? What is happening right now? I ask the questions. Okay, then do you mind asking yourself what you're doing? <laughs> oh! <laughs> Ow, what the hell? Tell me about the Gordas Project. <laughs> is that what this is about? <laughs> Look, Gordas is bad business. If you want a real hot investment, I am on the ground floor of some property on E. Okay, 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 okay. Don't be a smart ass. I'm not a patient person. So just start talking. Just where do you start when you're getting dragged through the desert and, uh. From the beginning. Right. I guess it all started with a promotion. See, I'd spent my entire career up at Hyperion, so I suppose that makes me one of the bad guys in this story. And Handsome Jack, he was the you baddest guy of them all. This long. It must feel and good I to want to be rabbit, just no? like him. Take it. It's yours, right? <laughs> I mean, you always <laughs> said that. Everyone did. I gotta be honest, I always thought it was sort of cheesy, but, uh, but hey, here Which we are. Which resulted in a company overflowing with assholes. Animals. When Handsome Jack died, it somehow got even worse. 
It took some time to fit in. <laughs> a few stabs and select backs, a new haircut, and the help of a couple friends, I was on my way to get the promotion that was going to change my life. Scratch that. Our lives for the better. I was a little distracted. It was a big day for us. Luckily, Vaughn was concentrating on the important things. What's the first thing you're going to buy? I know what Henderson's making. I do his payroll. The money man. If you're getting a fraction of what he earns, you'll be rolling in it. Yeah, there are a couple sweet rides I've been looking at. More fitting of the position I'm going to be in. Where the hell would you even drive that thing? We're in space. <laughs> I wouldn't actually use it. It would be more for looks. Oh, right. Well, then that's a great idea. We're meeting with a vet afterward to celebrate. She booked us a table. Yep. Sounds good. Look, we had to do a lot of awful stuff to get you to this point. Do I regret some of it? Sure I do. Every night it haunts my dreams, but that doesn't matter now. Because you made it. You deserve this, man. And don't ever think you don't. And don't ever think about the Iridium Mine deal we put together. Those people have to work somewhere, right? Hey, hey. We made it. Okay? We're in this together. If I'm moving up, we're all moving up. You can be certain of that. I appreciate that, Reese. You know, people around here have short memories when it comes to that stuff. You, me, Yvette, we're gonna run this place. Yes, we are. All right, man. Let's get that Hyperion face on. Oh, right, yeah. Hmm. No, oh, we need some condescending. It's a little too friendly right now. Okay, tell you what. Tilt your head back, uh, like if you ask me if there's anything up your nose. How's that? There you go. You don't respect me at all. Perfect. Mr. Henderson? Have a seat, Reese. I'll just be a second. No, I wasn't talking to you. Yes, I'm talking to you now. Damn, yeah, but I don't want it in guy. I want it in black. Because black is better. Look, don't concern yourself with why, okay, Jerry? Concern yourself with how. It's Patrick and just Wilbur. send the car over when it's ready. Company car. Didn't even have to ask. You look surprised to see me, Reese. And if I'm reading the situation right, and I usually am, you're not too happy about it either. This all came together quick. So, you might not have been in the loop, but it's for the better. At least for me. So where's Henderson? He, uh, stepped out. You're going to be reporting to me now, Reese. And I want you to know the promotion that you worked so hard to get. That's still coming to you. Well, that's a relief. <laughs> Cause I... But this is about more than that, Reese. It's about your future in this company. Look, you want to know the reason why I'm in that chair and you're not? For the exact same reason why North is North. Why the handsome guy always gets the girl. And why every spaceship in the universe is shaped like a cock. <laughs> it's destiny, race, And men, real men, men like me, make their own. And you can hold a grudge if you like. No harm, no foul, your thoughts are your own. But bad things can happen when you swim against fate. Sometimes men find themselves standing in the way of other men's destiny. Oh, shit. You don't want to be that man. <laughs> wow. I could not have timed that better. That really helps dramatically make my point. Which is this. This promotion is going to take you out of the way of other people's destiny. And put you on your own path. And that, my friend, is why I am promoting you to... Jerry, why isn't my new car digistructing in my office yet? Vasquez, it's August. Oh, August. Uh, yeah, cool, listen. Uh, I actually have somebody here with me, so... Uh... Are you buying this vault key, or what? Because I... How did this happen so quick? I thought I'd have more time. Of course I'm still interested. I... Yes, I'm near a computer. Ten million, yeah. It's just that's a lot of money to get together on short notice. I 
mean I'm not trying to be obstinate, but I need time. And that, my friends, is our uh, motion. Three years sucking up to the guy out the window. Yeah, 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 no, but... That's rough, man. Oof. What are the biggest scumbags Do always have the best view? Do you want the money or not? Because I... Good point. Oh, that should be me. Only less... It's not. No, it won't be a big deal for me to get... So as you guys know, I really love Telltale and I really love Borderlands, so I figure, what the heck, why don't I do both? Yes. Had a really hard time because my previous capture card would not allow me to capture yeah, that's any what we real had before. games. So I went out and I am running the Asus Strix 970, it's a and it is August, fantastic. And I just got this promotion. It is pretty darn amazing. So in the upper right hand corner you'll see something with a Q. If you go into Q, no. you go into like scan mode. Uh, look, 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 are you going? Now I played the first little bit just to get all the stuff set up. Why are you turning this into a whole Soul thing right now? Waiter, Pisces. Favorite donut? That kind with spring. What Status? A waste. Not, not well. Not Such a <laughs> nice suit. So when I play through this, uh, you know I'm gonna hopefully know what I'm gonna Look, do. But I'll aside from that, I'm just gonna enjoy the game and everything that has to do with it. Personal catchphrases: Rock and roll, lock and load, ain't no thing, but a chicken wing. I don't know. I added that part. Uh, but anyways, let's remote access. Yeah, 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 yeah. No, but currently viewing one encrypted file. Let's open that one. Do you want the money or not? Because I... Why are you trying to screw me on this? Oh, fine. Just wait there, okay? I can only be down it. If it's going to be $10 million, I'm going to need another hour or two. Okay. Yeah, I'll be there in a bit. Well, then just stay there. It's a tourist shop, right? Buy a mug or something. Sure. 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 Okay, say hi to your mom. Damn it! Ah, right. Now, what were we talking about? Before we were... so... Rudely interrupted. You were lecturing me. It was taking a while. <laughs> All right, your uh, promotion. Anderson was a fool. He didn't know his place. He needed lesson number one. Humility. But you, I respect you, Reese. That's why I'm going to make you assistant vice janitor. What? What? No. No, you, you, you can't. I'm the boss now, Reese. I do whatever I want. Report to Sewage Scout 23. Effective immediately. Fine. I've had to do worse in my career. That's the spirit, Reese. Nothing teaches you humility faster than scrubbing toilets. You're dismissed, Reese. We're going to take it from the aspect of sucking up to him at least enough to where we can do whatever... Plot. I'll let you know when I need my trash can emptied. Because I'll bet you there's going to be a plot for that. What the hell was that? He can't do this to us. He just did. No. No, no. This can't be happening. I'm finished, Bob. I'm finished. You know this place is. There's blood in the water, and everyone can smell it. No, 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 they can't. Not yet, unless you don't quiet down. We just gotta keep it on the down low until we figure something out. It's not that bad yet. Senior Vice Janitor Reese to Sector D451 for trash cleanup. Huh. 
because that is your job now to clean up trash with your bare hands. Sorry, you were saying something. I interrupted you. Reese, why are you cleaning up trash? I thought you were getting a promotion. Trash duty seems like the opposite of a promotion. Henderson's dead. What? Are you sure? Yeah. I mean, you can ask him yourself. He's floating outside in space! It's that prick Vasquez. <sighs> he threw Henderson out of an airlock and demoted Reese to Trash Man. Holy crap! So, does that mean you're not buying? <laughs> Positions and lunch lady. Lunch leech. Well, just trying to lighten the mood. And I didn't bring my wallet, so if someone pays for me... I'll tell you who's gonna pay. Vasquez. I don't know if he's the type we to... We can't let that prick get away with this. We need to do something. He just killed a guy. Maybe it's better we lay low for a bit. What? No way. We hit back. We steal his deal. We steal his deal. Yes! That is what I'm talking about. What are you talking about? Vasquez set up a deal on Pandora for a vault key. Whoa. That must be why he got the promotion. The only thing Hyperion cares about more than money is its vault keys. It's perfect! I mean, not only do we screw over Asquez, we have a friggin' vault key! What are they worth? Like a billion dollars? More. Yeah, but we need ten million dollars right now to make the deal. Hold, please. Done. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. That was impressive. I'm in accounting. I mean, it's, it's what I do. Ten million bucks is chump change around here. By the time anyone notices, we'll have a vault key. Cool. Well, looks like you boys got it all figured out. I'm gonna go eat. Alone? Call me if you don't get killed, Whoa, 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 right? hey, hey, we need your help. We need clearance, transportation. You're a requisitions master. We need that stuff. Yeah, maybe a loader bot or two. You know, things get dicey. Look. It's one thing stealing from a bunch of poor suckers on Pandora. You're talking about stealing from Hyperion. But we're friends. Friends help each other steal stuff. I mean, that's how it works. Richter used to steal candy bars. His family still doesn't know where the body is. Richter was an asshole and his family are assholes. Come on, I'll buy you the lunch I owe you when we get back. Fine. But you're buying me lunch now and when you get back. <laughs> Done. We only got a couple hours. Go withdraw the cash. I'll get you guys clearance to Pandora, get you geared up, and issue you a standard Hyperion town car. What? Standard? Really? I mean, you can't spring for premium? Seat warmers, maybe a convertible <laughs> or something? Sure, yeah, a convertible. So, just so I got this straight, you want me to get you a car to drive around Pandora that leaves you less protected, right? Look, it just... You're gonna steal something, I uh, figure... No. No, don't worry. I've got a car in mind. Oh, yeah. Well, that's part one, guys. Hope you guys enjoy it. Stay tuned for part two. It's been Pitching 888. Over and out.